It's a toy. It's a toy. What is wrong with that toy? What I address in the video is not so much the mermaid doll as the ideology behind the fact that we as parents, you know, I, personally, I think it's ridiculous because it's like we become so politically correct that our brains have fallen out of our head when Target has to remove from their shelves any sort of, I, of, of idea that a toy is meant to be boy or meant to be girl. The good, good. Yes. No, because, because what I know about child development and as somebody who studies children and works with children and works in school, I, I, listen, I, I know that if we can nurture children for who they are, they will find their own paths. And yes, there is just a place. Let them make mistakes. Let, let, let them choose one thing. Just, just because I want to have you both sure. get the floor, Mickey wanted to, to yeah, say something. Yeah, I would like to say possible. something. I think the fundamental difference between you and I, I reached out sure. to you on Facebook, and sure. I really want to commend you for answering me back, and we had a dialogue via email. And so I, my, my um, objective here is, the, is two men that are entirely different archetypes, for us to find a dialogue that will actually have us not pitted against each other, but we'll, that I will, I will never agree with, with your ideologies, right. and right. You, you may never agree with mine. But we don't need to trash each other, okay? Well, That's yeah. all, all. Um, the, you know, the fundamental mental differences between you and I, as the way I see it, is that I believe that all people are born good, and you believe that all people are born sinners. And I think that that, that that simple idea has us lose trust in the children to actually choose their highest choice. And so when we don't give the children the freedom to actually step up and, and exercise and cultivate their innate intuition and intelligence, they end up being followers in the system, and that's where trouble begins. Okay, so... so. First of all, as far as, as you b believing that people are all born good and I believe that they're all born evil, I believe that people were obviously created in the image of God, that obviously that through sin, that yes, that we have a fallen sin nature, but I do believe that we have an ability to come to a relationship with Jesus Christ in which we are now able to then have the, His goodness fill us. So, mm -hmm. so... I don't think it's an issue of, of, of believing that everybody's bad. No. I just think Josh, that... Well, I want to say one thing, sure. and, and because we have to move on. But I think it comes down to this. You're right, as a parent, you do shape your children. Right. But there's a big difference between telling your children to stay away from, say, drugs, don't drink and drive, and picking out a mermaid doll. You know, and, and so my, my issue is you have to understand that... I understand your ideology, I get it, and everyone can have their own choice in life in terms of what ideology they follow. But, but when you're- I say one thing, you cannot mold someone's sexuality. Okay, and see. That, that is it. When it comes to something like gender, watch, watch, watch. When it comes to something like gender, this is a biological classification. Okay, my, my issue is that you have people like the University of Tennessee that's now saying that we cannot celebrate gender, that we have to use the pronoun Z instead of his or hers. I'm saying this, my wife and I are biologically different and we are different genders and you know what? We celebrate that. It's not that one's subservient to the other or that, hey, you know, I, I, my, my, my inbox has been filled with people saying, your ideas are so old fashioned and outdated. I would argue that there's a big difference between being old fashioned and outdated and being ancient. And when it comes to gender roles, you're talking about something that has been around culture to culture, that's been around since the beginning of man, something that we find all throughout biology, whether it's the animal kingdom or human life, we find that there's different gender roles. And I think that that's okay for us to celebrate that rather than, than, than sit around and say, hey, we need to rip this pronoun out or we can't talk about this or we have to totally uh, make the target shelves look like, you know, they, they've been whitewashed and, and we can't market towards this demographic of boys and girls. Hey, <laughs> hey guess what? I, I, played, I played with my sister's dolls in her dollhouse and... It doesn't make... And here look, you are. Yeah. Look at You're me. Guy. Look at Dr. Gordon. <laughs> The beauty of our society, at least in, in this great country, is that people can express their own opinions, and that's one thing that I think we treasure here. So, Joshua, thank you for expressing your